Ever found yourself going back to a particular habit you swore you'd never do again? Well, you and all the other people on the planet have the same problem. But congratulations on clicking on this video, where we'll be sharing with you three simple but very effective methods to break bad habits, so make sure you watch till the end. Human beings are far from perfect, and we tend to indulge in some habits and activities that might not be beneficial to us. But the good news is that as good habits can be learnt, bad habits can also be unlearnt. And in this video, we're going over how to do just that. Hello, and welcome to our channel! Breaking bad and unwanted habits is no easy task, especially if they're habits that you've had for a long time. In fact, it is harder to break bad habits than pick up good ones. This is because most of these habits are things we enjoy or derive pleasure from, so we subconsciously repeat them constantly. They're also easy to fall back on on times of weakness. This is when we tell ourselves, one more wouldn't hurt. But in the long run, they actually do hurt. The first step in successfully breaking unwanted habits is to identify them. For example, if you want to stop snoozing your alarm too many times, you should identify that snoozing it more than three times is wrong and decide to snooze your alarm only once. Identifying the unwanted habit will give you more willpower to break it. The next step tackles a mistake many people make when they try to break a bad habit and how to avoid making it. Let's check it out. To successfully break a bad habit, write down your whys. A mistake people make when trying to break a bad habit is to leave their whys in their head. Just as you write down your goals, writing down the reasons you need to break a particular habit will make it seem more doable and intentional. When you're tempted to indulge in that habit again, just find your whys and they will help you think logically and overcome that moment of weakness. This last step is a personal favorite and it's a very effective one. Keep watching to find out what it is. Finding yourself and creating obstacles. Yup, you heard that right. Find yourself. You don't have to necessarily do this with money. You could simply deprive yourself of something you enjoy doing at any time you go back to that habit. Let's say you're trying to stop midnight snacks. Anytime you go back to it, you could find yourself by depriving yourself of your favorite TV show. This will give you a sense of responsibility and makes you less prone to going back to the habit. Nonetheless, having a reward system will also help you motivate to keep on going. If any of these tips have worked for you, let us know in the comment section below. If you're finding this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to ring the bell so you don't miss any notifications from us and check out our channel for more helpful videos.